What's up, beautiful people? It's your best friend on the other side. Another beautiful Sunday afternoon. Greetings. I'm sure it is a beautiful month of October, yeah, man. See, I'm going to go see a show shell towards the finish line. Hey, now, go, Gangambelu 2022. You know, we just yesterday at the Guchun, and now it's October. Just two more months left. You know, when I was growing up, there was a time where I used to play sports, a lot of sports, and my high school coach used to teach us something that was very important about life. He used to say, young boys, one thing I need you to understand is that when you see the finish line, don't run to the finish line, but run through the finish line. And I know each and every one of us, we are ready, we are worried about which, what are we going to do. And now we are paying, and now we are going to have I saved enough. And now we are going to Oh my God, I want to finish the whole the house, La Pekaya, and the renovation. And then he ends up. Oh my is actually stressing out about who take a nine and more diesel tart. Anyway. A very beautiful Sunday evening. I'm I want to come into your space just for a minute or two and give you something, you know, that will help you start the week in a better space of mind. Shout out to everybody that has been following the Rise and Grind and showing us some love. We truly appreciate it. Don't forget to share this and tell a friend to tell a friend. I'm I want to tackle a topic that is very important that continues to live in my life every time when it comes to this part of the year. I want to tell you into Eti this time of the year one of my favorite focus topics even in my coaching sessions even in the platforms and give one people invite me to come and talk to what my year-end functions you know but one thing i always tell them is at this time of the year we need to focus on finishing strong I don't know how many of you know the runner in sprint. I said Jamaica who holds the record for the fastest man in the planet, Usain Bolt. One of his philosophies in running is like some of us in Pilwen, you can beat us on January, February, March, April, May, June, July. But one thing that is our quality is we are here to Usain Bolt. You can beat me, Menga Bixa Sowa, Menga Be Isakalis Palmas. It's a goal. But the minute I see the finish line, I focus on finishing strong. And I'm on this beautiful Sunday afternoon. I want to come into your space and say to you, focus on finishing strong. We are Pelunyaga. You lost a lot of um, uh, things. They may balegi legwen. I'm happy you lost a house. You lost a car. I'm happy you lost a loved one. I'm happy you had given up even on love. I'm happy you have reached a point where you like, you know what, fortune. It's a tough time of the year, and I'm about to give up. If you look at right now, I want you to pull up the strength that you have. It's one more lap to go, one more move to go. Give it your all, give it your best. This is the time where you pull up everything that you have. October is the month where you go after the craziest opportunity that you ever thought of. You see that idea alone at the back of your head? that you think is impossible, it's time to go after them. I want you to start planning that event. This is the time to plan those things. This is the time to start thinking about the impossible things that you thought were not possible. I want to tell you when you focus on finishing strong, the impossible are achieved. When you focus on finishing strong, you become a cut above the rest. When you focus on finishing strong, you become unstoppable. In my book, Think Excellence, I speak about something very important. I speak about about if you can see it in your mind, you can hold it in your hands. If you can see it in your mind, you can achieve it in your body. So whatever it is that you believe is possible for you, I want to tell you it's possible. In that job, remember you are behind on your sales, you are behind on your numbers, you are behind on some of the customers that you're supposed to bring on board. I want to tell you now you can do the impossible. Go after the client that you thought will never say yes to you. Yes, I'm talking about that client. We are not this is the time. You pick up that phone, you dial that client, 
you sell your product. If you are in business and you're an entrepreneur, I want to tell you right now, it is the month of transport. It is the month, last Kuluma Kona, about the season of planting. I want you to go out and plant if you're a gardener. Plant, sow your seed of greatness. Sow your seed so that you become better. You are exceptional. You are unstoppable. You got what it takes to push towards the finish line. And I want you to take these three things as we wrap up Unyaraga 2022. I want to say to you, number one, what you focus on is what you will achieve. Where your focus goes, your energy flows. The problem, Gawe, you are focused on the failures. You are focused on You are focused on from achieving the dream. You are focused on I want to tell you right now, focus on the possibilities. Imagine Imagine you are ready to give up. I'm saying to you, my brother, my sister, send one more CV. There's a breakthrough coming your way. There's something great moving your way. We are finishing strong. But I'm telling you, your opportunity is right here. If you focus on winning, winning becomes a part of your life. The reason you are winning, it's because you are focused on the possibilities of not winning. So I want you to start focusing on winning. Remember, number one, very important, if you focus on finishing strong, is to understand this very important element. And this element will help your life. Where your focus goes, your energy flows. Number two, very importantly, if you're going to finish 2022 strong, I want you to hold this in your heart. I want to tell you this. Focus on running through the finish line, not to the finish line. Yeah, you heard me right. Omundu okichima to the finish line. Omundu engondu eniake. Mesek figo October. Usuge se apply ama break. We are not applying brakes. We are not stopping. We are firing through to the finish line. We will run through the finish line because I'm a puppet. Our paid December. I'm a puppet in January. As of a valid. Your dreams in January will still be helping you become better. Your goals, your business, your ideas, your workplace. Nango January as of a second. So ask Jimmy towards December. We are running through December. Si pegel 2023. October. You've got to pull up your socks. Not just pull up your socks, but also new summer songs. Masu wa new sile, masu ya kalu, kokishet lako, ukokiskifa saku ya stonta. Get ready because this is when the real work gets going. We ask menga begwa kiumuzi. Everybody talks about the foundation. Nogba lega kwe foundation. But I want to tell you, we are done with the foundation now. Segu buge kwe pili del pege pezulu. You are halfway through that building. One day, sponuguti masbugi pupo lago. Sit, what a beautiful building. The foundation is important, but how you finish is also important. So I'm saying to you, we are running through the finish line. Jengoba, my high school coach teacher, used to always say, ask it, you may live we are December. So, but then I'm say, Let's not make the mistakes we always do. We have a seven to Nyaga Waka Utko December with Pepe Yonki Doyenzi. No, 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 no. This year, we are investing for February. I was just telling the team right here as we were chatting, Uguti, I'm actually uh, almost going to be done with my book. If we're glad, let's start to uh, in merit to the hustle and say, Lord Janini, go February. I am running through with December. I'm not even looking at the finish line. I'm looking to the next year. So I'm saying to you right now, as you are viewing this on a beautiful Sunday afternoon, go to the drawing board. Ask yourself, Uguti, are you finishing strong to stop or are you finishing strong to start the next year at a better place? And then the last point, and most important point. I want to tell you this. If you are focusing on finishing strong, one of the most important thing is also focus on staying mentally healthy. Yeah, you got me right. You deserve to be fresh and ready to take on the final lap. Go out to Glea Brian and Majita, who figure relax, Uber Grand Uboy, Masuboya, who's all spanner because you are well rested. Hambi Kayo Bonabantana Baku, Bau Babom Tan, Mshampu Shaili Traki. You don't want to be one of Lava Banta Batiwa, Babangingos and Quake. It is still transport man. So Mzoti Gwena, you don't want to be those people. So go and rest yourself. Take some time out and get ready to finish strong. Because when you are well rested, when your body is functioning proper, you are ready to finish strong. 
At first, I didn't understand why my high school coach teacher used to always say to us, if it's a big race, that day before the race, we don't train, we rest. I didn't understand the philosophy of rest, but resting gives you the power to come back stronger, to finish strong. So, when I say October, man, November, not December. I want to tell you that God can do anything within one month. God can change your life in one month. God can make your business successful in one month. God can give you that job in one month. God can transform your life in one month. But it begins with you focusing on finishing strong. And I wish you all the best as you go back to the drawing board to rebuild your strength, to rebuild your greatness. And remember, where your energy goes, your focus also must go. Wherever you are, don't forget to rest before you go back again. You owe it to yourself, you owe it to your family, you owe it to the people that love you, that look at you every day. And from me, that's my message to you this week. Let's focus on finishing 2022 stronger than we started. We may have started it on the back foot. We may have stumbled and fell. We can't bend the lane, cut a lily, what we shall give up. But I'm saying to you now, you still have the opportunity to get up and finish strong. Now, come on, family. Call the kids to come around. Join us as we do our affirmation. It's about to be the beginning of a new week. Will you put your hand on your chest, just like how I do? Let's speak it to life. Say these, with, these words with me and make sure you mean each and every one. Say, I am blessed. I am powerful. I will finish strong. All things are coming my way. This is my time. This is my moment. I may have started weak, but I'm finishing strong. My thoughts are becoming things. This is my time. And for a difference this week, say these words with me. This is a prayer for all the hustlers, the believers, those who want to become better. Let's pray together. Father God, God bless our hustle. Amen. Thank you very much for tuning in to the Rise and Grind. Let's meet again next week. And I'm telling you, I've got a power-packed topic for you. Make sure you don't even subscribe. In fact, tell a friend to tell a friend to come through. Subscribe to the Gaga CFM platform on YouTube. Make sure Guting, you are part of our community. On Facebook, you're part of our community. On Instagram, go and press that like button and follow us. And make sure that our putwa eluta and also get on TikTok. Don't forget, Gaga CFM. We are South Africa's number one commercial radio station, Shop Shop.